All right, listen, man. The New York Jets are currently 4-2. They just took down the Green Bay Packers. I got to tell you, the culture, when I watch these Jets games right now, this team is going to be feared in a handful of years, and it could just, it, it is starting right now. Let's just, let's call a spade a spade. It's starting right now. The defense on this team, Sauce Gardner, the culture they are building on both sides of the ball, is, it's crazy. It is so fun to watch. And take this from a Green Bay Packers fan. The reason I'm making a Jets video right here right now is because we just got decimated. 27 to 10. I loved the New York Jets. I loved watching them. I had to do some film. I had to do some studies. And I'm loving what I'm seeing. Like, the coaching staff, the players. I'll tell you, man. This is a team to fear. Zach Wilson, the swagger on him. Brees Hall, Elijah Moore. I mean, man, they are so fun. Garrett Wilson has already turned into a stud. And that's on the offense right now. That's on the offense. Defensively, Quincy Williams, CJ Mosey, Jordan Whitehead, Mike Carter II, Lamarcus Joyner, DJ Reed, Sauce Gardner. Sauce Gardner is a stud. Man, if you watch college football, you watched Cincinnati play last season. You, you're not very surprised right now. The New York Jets, what's crazy is their top six players on both sides of the ball are in their first or second year. First or second year. This team is so united. Now, they have the talent, all right? They have the talent, and they're playing amazing right now. Like I said, Elijah Moore, Garrett Wilson, Brees Hall. I'm a huge Brees Hall supporter. I saw that. Before he got drafted, when he got drafted, not from necessarily Jets fans, but from NFL media, there was there were question marks. I didn't see him. Brees Hall's that guy. All right. Michael Carter, where they drafted him, especially. Man. <laughs> you really stole one there. If you guys are enjoying this and you want more Jets videos, be sure to hit that like button, hit that sub button as I post daily NFL content and I I'm going to make more Jets videos regardless. Try and get this video to 50 likes because I'm watching these Jets and they are fun, they are fast, and they're filled with playmakers. I could make a video on every single one of their players on both sides of the ball. Both sides of the ball. We haven't even began to see what Zach Wilson is capable of. Like I said, the swagger he has, the confidence he has, the, some of the throws he makes, you know, we saw the sidearms like... He's a playmaker. They're building a culture. And I feel like culture is often overlooked. These guys are buying into the program as they should. Their coaches, Robert, LaFleur, I mean, these guys know exactly what they're doing. They know exactly what they're doing and they're buying into it. They're drinking the Kool-Aid. They're drinking the Kool-Aid. They've had some impressive ass wins this season, most recently. First off, they're 3-0 on the road. It's not easy winning road football games, all right? There's a lot of stuff that goes into it, especially beating the Green Bay Packers on the road. The way they managed that game, the turnovers they caused, they controlled every aspect of that football game. And as a Green Bay Packer fan, it frustrated me, right? I want better from the Green Bay Packers. But well, you got to give props where props are due. You got to give respect where respect is due. The New, York, the New York Jets, they have my respect. And I'm going to be keeping a close eye on them for the rest of the season. But not only the rest of the season. I'm going to be keeping an eye on them for the next five seasons at least. I mean, they're only going to keep getting better. They're only going to keep adding on. It's crazy, man. I'm absolutely loving it. Let me know what you guys are thinking about the New York Jets down below. Hit that like button. Hit that sub button. I'll see you guys later.